Hey folks, this is Jeff with This Week with JTT. And I uh, saw the latest news that um, Steve Harvey has refuted rumors about problems between him and Marjorie and all that. He said, like, him and Marjorie are all right, and which is cool. You know, that's a good thing. Now, you're probably wondering, why do rumors like that keep popping up? You know, like, there's a lot of different sources. Some say it could be his kids saw the rumors, the internet itself. But keep this in mind. The bodyguard, for example, the dude was a former pimp. So that in itself, you know, maybe go, they could go like, whoa, time out. Marjorie's ex-husband is a less honorable man. And she, you know, was involved in some weird genetic business, what have you not. So basically her past is questionable. So basically anybody with a, with a questionable past and when rumors come out, Rumors usually take like a strong hold to it to a point where people say swear up and down like, oh, she cheated, oh, she wanted to divorce Steve Harvey and all that. But here's the thing. Unless Steve Harvey comes out and saying, you know, it's done, it's over and all that. I mean, if it's public knowledge, yeah, like Jada Pinkett with Will Smith. We all know she had an affair with August I seen because she told that to Will Smith's face, as well as all of us on Facebook, um, Red Table Talk. But until Steve Harvey says it, like, no, leave it be. Simple as that. But rumors is like, when it comes to rumors, you seriously got to take it with a grain of salt. Unless you know it's public knowledge, it's nothing more but rumors. Other than that, folks, like I said before last time, keep your nose clean. Peace.